Hello everyone and welcome back to The Escapists. Uh, it's been a few days since the last time I did this, do apologise. Computer blew up, which was not a nice thing. But as you can see, I've played ahead again a little bit, pre-collected a load of stuff. We're going to have another uh, break and attempt just as soon as we can. My goodness. We've just had a fight that didn't involve Pierre. Amazing. Anyway, um... Right, happy 4th of July weekend to those of you guys who uh, celebrate it. Um, if you happen to be British and you need something, a reason for the party, this was the week in which William the Conqueror ascended to the British throne in uh, 1066. It's as good as reason as any for a party, isn't it? Okay, yeah, on this subject, I, um, I have a number of American friends console me over the loss of the colonies or um, ask if I celebrate the 4th of July N well to be honest with you no I don't really feel the need to celebrate uh, William the Conqueror ascending to the British throne uh, th thank you for asking but uh, no not really um, oh bleach need some of that uh, bed sheets don't need some of that um, yeah I mean, I must admit, it was it's it is a shame what happened to that piece of history. Uh, it would have been nice if perhaps we hadn't had a mad king or uh, a corrupt parliament or incredibly greedy merchants. Uh, perhaps America could have been part of the Commonwealth and we could have lived together, sharing the knowledge of the rules of cricket, say, or had an agreement on what the word football actually means. But no, I don't think it really matters that much anymore. Um, I'm glad you guys have a good excuse for a party, and I hope you don't have too large a headaches on Monday morning when you go back to work. But there is one thing I would like to talk about. I'm really offended by what you did to all that tea. That's just not cricket. <sighs> okay, moving on. What you guys do to, to, to tea is just terrible, even these days, I've got to be honest. Do I have anything? Nope. Okay, now who do I want that bleach for? Um, tub of bleach for Ross. Let's see if we can find Ross. Um, I don't think I'll object too much to the loss of Ross, but it would be nice to see him nonetheless. Uh, there you go. Uh, go. Pierre, not beaten up for a second. That makes a change. Come on, where are you? Ricky, Carl... Ross! Hello, Ross. Have a tub of bleach. There you go. All that for $19. Okay, let's sit down and eat some dinner. Alright. Um, I'm seeing... Uh, Pierre, there you go. That's a surprise. I'm seeing a two-stage escape process. We'll have that. We won't have the trowel because we can't get it through. Plastic entrance key. Yep, we knew that one. Okay. I'm seeing a two-stage escape process. The first time we'll go cut through the vents and the second one we will go up onto the roof, see if we can go up where we need to go up, down where we go need to go down. Yeah, it's like those magazine men in their flying machines but wearing orange jumpsuits. Why not? And make a break for freedom. What I will do... Oh, oh, schmeg. <laughs> oh, come on, let's just beat me up. There you go. Boink. And. What the hell was that about? <laughs> it's like I got bored halfway through it. And... <laughs> okay, never mind. Yes, where was I? Uh, yeah. Two step process. Um, but the thing I'm really going to do, the lesson I've learned. Is I'm gonna go and up and have a look on the roof first before uh, making the stupid mistake of carrying all that kit up there, and hopefully um, we will be able to get up without instantly getting caught. In other news, um, we did a, um, a live stream on Wednesday, had a load of fun playing Terraria, but the the, the highlight of it, and it's, it's been posted by now, so hopefully you've all seen it. The highlight of it was the fact that um, we um, got to escape. The, the the character we were playing on the Escapists uh, live stream, Yoho, managed to tunnel his way out, which I thought was pretty impressive and really happy about. Uh, there we 
So that, that was that was loads of fun, and th thank you very much to those who made it, and uh, hopefully those who didn't will be able to make to one in the future. Uh, the mass game of Terraria we played afterwards was loads of fun as well, I've got to be honest with you. Quite enjoyed that. Okay, dinner, we will do a little bit of exercising. Um, what state are we in? Okay, let's just get intellects up to 100, work a little bit on speed, and then um, I think I'll just check to make sure I've got everything I need for the first step of the escape attempt tonight. And then we'll get out of here. We'll do the first bit towards getting out of here and get ready for tomorrow. It would be incredibly nice to get this guy out before the 9th because we can almost guarantee that uh, this uh, this save file will not work with the new game. So it's important we get that done. Right, oh, how is everyone? I hope you guys are having a nice weekend. Um, I'm, I'm fairly certain the Americans amongst you are having a nice weekend, or at least I certainly hope so. Um, it's yeah, it's it's a it's a it's a very good celebration to have. I mean, our big celebration of a similar one is Guy Fawkes Night, where we celebrate the fact that somebody failed to blow up Parliament. You know, come to think of it, your celebration is pretty much the opposite, isn't it? Never mind. It's always a good excuse to have a party, isn't it? Yes. Actually, uh, um, Guy Fawkes Night, a traditionally British celebration. I don't think there's many other countries in the world would celebrate the fact that uh, somebody was part of a plot to blow up Parliament, failed to blow up Parliament, mostly because, if I remember right, uh, he was pretty much shopped by all of his friends. He was then hung, corn, drawn and quartered. And if you don't know what that means, look it up. But uh, don't if you're squeamish. And we celebrate it by making a copy of him in effigy and setting fire to it on a, a cold November's night. And then standing around the fire eating sausages and setting off fireworks to celebrate the fact that this guy probably wasn't that good at plotting but still better than nothing isn't it All right nearly time to uh, go for evening roll call just want to check in Ricky's desk because I've been using that to store bits and pieces nothing I want in there okay so we'll just wait here so right, we'll do roll call we will then go and put together our escape kit gets uh, as the kit to the stairway as quick as much as possible. Go to sleep, and tomorrow we shall make the escape bid. There we go. Evening roll call. Your your king has arrived. Modest chap, isn't he? Okay, we're not going to have our cell search. That means we can go ahead and. Uh, do the business tonight. Um, right. Uh, okay, let's see if we can pick up another job just in case we're here tomorrow. Is there anyone here that doesn't like us that needs a job? Ricky doesn't need a job. So, oh. Pierre, what a surprise. Don't need any of that. Okay. Right. Let's get up here. Alright, okay, um, we'll have that, we'll have that, we'll drop that for a minute because we don't need it, we need one of those, timber, okay, so let's start making a shovel, so for that we need a tool handle, and sheet of metal and duct tape gives us a flimsy shovel, shovel. okay, so then, duct tape and sheet of metal, craft that together, well, Wrong one. Get out. And that one gives us a lightweight shovel and finally sheet of metal. Tape for ducks. Doink, doink, doink. Gives us a sturdy shovel. Okay, we're gonna drop that off. Oh, I've forgotten about key again, haven't I? Alright. 
So we will have with us, well actually all we need at the moment is the sturdy cutters. So let's grab the sturdy cutters and let's get ourselves through these slats. Right, um, the escape equipment will be the shovel, the grappling hook and the step ladder and I will take a bit of food with me for the rest just in case that we do something that makes us run out of energy. Okay, there we go. I am tempted really to see what's down here one day, but not tonight. Let's get through these slats. This sturdy cutter is so much better than anything else. It's well worth the effort made putting into it. I'm very, very much hoping that this shovel will pay off just as well. Lots of uh, digging for very little actual energy effort. There we go, we're through. Right, we shall drop off the shovel. I want to put these uh, cutters back here. Come on, there we go. Because if anything goes wrong, we can pick them up again and use them for the, uh, for the next escape attempt. So we need those, we need that. I think a couple of bars of chocolate is going to be more than enough really, isn't it? So we're sure... Right, I'm just going to drop these off. And we're now prepared for tomorrow. So, let's just neaten things up here a little bit. And I think, because I don't think I remember using it that, that before, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab that staff key. We'll have these items as well because I always carry them around with me. And tomorrow we shall grab, use that staff key, just have a little play around. We may as well, hadn't we? There we go. Right, I've just got to remember not to walk under a metal detector with it. So, right, I'm going to sleep, I'm going to restart the game, and we'll carry on with the next day of hopefully our last escape attempt for this playthrough. Right back again just turn the music and the sound effects off oh let's get rid of the last bit of that fatigue if we can just reduce that fat all right let's uh get out of here before we get put into lockdown again Raphael, what are you after no not interested in helping you there leroy what do you got to sell nothing that i'm interested in let's hope i don't lose the next stat ladder uh, Nope, nothing there. Okay. I'm shame I've never really found a use for flashlights and candles and things like that. Even when digging out, there seems to be enough light in the game to not need them. Right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to skip breakfast. I'm just going to hide because I don't want to walk into the kitchens with that. Nope, Ronald, you've got nothing I'm interested in, so I'm just going to hide back in my cell here. Um... Let's have a quick look here. Don't know why, but let's have a quick look here anyway. We do have the makings of another shovel if we need one. And we still have that hammer, and I'd like to use that hammer to see if I can get through a wall. I don't particularly want to take this fake vent cover off, because I get the feeling that, uh, yes, yeah, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, that's going to break the next time I take it down. The vent covers seem to lose about 20% of their life per use. So taking one down counts as a use, putting one up counts as a use. Right, let's make some number plates. And once we've made some number plates, we'll use that key quickly. Oh, two, three, four. There we go. Right, come on. Oh. How if I was clicking on the right thing there, really, wouldn't it? Okay, so. Boink. Doink, doink, job done. Easiest job in the game, that one. Okay, anyone looking? Nobody's looking. Let's unlock that door. Ah, oh, I can't get through there. That looks like there was supposed to be a door there, but it's not there. Um, if you see that this is not curving up, it's allowing a passageway through. I get the impression that's supposed to be a door. Never mind. At least we tried it out. That looks like a coffee machine. Little kettle in a cup there. Very nice. 
Uh huh. Okay. Never mind. Alright. Okay. Let's go and have some lunch. Do a bit of exercise in this afternoon. Let him get away because otherwise he'll just carry on adding 10% to my heat. There we go. Just in time to walk in on another fight. Just a time to walk out for midday roll call. Yay. So yes, if you don't know, this will be out on Steam Early Access on the 9th, I'm letting you understand. Um, should be a totally different version to what's here now. Um, uh, there's a loads more, loads more stuff that's been put in, a load of bug fixes. Hopefully you can see that door now. But that's a... Uh, hmm. That's rather annoying. Um, and that door gave us one use. That, that key gave us one use. So if there's two doors into a staff room, in order to actually get into the staff room, you're going to need two keys. Which is... Hmm. A little bit unfair, I'd say. Perhaps there's a way of making those plastic keys more efficient. Yeah, perhaps we need some molten metal instead of molten plastic. But never mind. No, I must admit, oh, yes, while we've got a bit of free time, I've been asked to do the next breakout attempt this way. If you go over here, here's the front gate. I'm willing to bet with a file, you should be able to get through there and just walk out. Of course, we've got to stop, we've got to do it in a way that doesn't arouse Officer Whitney's uh, suspicions here. Yeah, here's what I, here's what I, uh, no, okay. Right, yeah, you can get in there, sorry. Um, uh, managed to derail, derail my own train of thought there, do apologise. Yes, um, yes, this is the door I was looking at. If you see this doorway here, um, it doesn't actually look like there's walls here like that, do you see? Yes, I'm getting myself in so much trouble showing this. So... Oh, going the wrong way. No, I'm not. Let's go and have some exercise instead. Right, my computer. That was really annoying. Yes, uh, Thursday morning, because it was uh, close to the start of the month. Set up a backup, went to work. Came home from work. My computer was quiet. Turn the computer on. There's a clunk. There's a groan. There's a beep. And turns out that uh, one of the hard disks, a very old two terabyte hard disk that I've had on this computer for years, had decided that today was the day to give up the ghost. And as a result, had to go out and buy a new hard disk. I've got a three terabyte hard disk in its place now, very nice. Um, and um, let's just drop these things while I'm thinking about it. I uh, just want to pick them up again in the right order. Otherwise, it gets in the way. My CDO gets in the way. Um, yes, uh, I'm thinking to pick up a new hard disk. Go. So, went to have a look at the backup of uh, my games and recording and data directory and all that. And of course, because it had died, bottle of medicine, wonderful. Need that. Oh, oh. Um, Yes, because it died mid backup, my backup was corrupted, so I had to download an older backup. Fortunately, I had an older backup. What's the stats look like? I think we're probably good enough. Let's do a bit of strength because we're digging tonight. So that took a lot of thir Thursday, well into Friday to get sorted out. And I've been straightening things out over the weekend, which is why you haven't heard much from me. I do apologise. I did put up some uh, downloads of the live stream we had on Wednesday. I hope you guys enjoyed those because uh, they were loads of fun for us. Let's just get rid of this fatigue quickly before evening roll call. Just quickly duck into the sh oh no, yeah, let's duck into the showers because he's break dancing. He's probably not. Oh god, no. There we go. Right, let's just get rid of that. I, I 
never really got the fighting mechanics in this game and if I ever am given the opportunity to do so I would just rather run away from a fight and use our uh, superior speed. So right, here we are. Fingers crossed this will be the last day of this particular breakthrough. Breakthrough? Breakout! Breakout, that's the word. Last day of this particular breakout. If not, I shall save this, upload this, and I'll do another another one this evening to make up for the lack of uh, episodes you guys have had today. My apologies for that, but computers, they go foom from time to time. The annoying thing is that my my house is like normally like a computer's graveyard. It's uh, the place where good computers go to die. Bottle of medicine for Adele. But at the, I've been trying to tidy things up because I want to uh, just get rid of this house over the next year and buy a new place. And in order to do that, I wanted to get a bit more organised than I normally am, which is not. Oh, of course, I don't have any half-dead computers lying around at the moment to steal bits out of. Uh, nope, not interested in doing that. Not really interested in doing any of them. I don't know why I'm even looking. Let's make a start, shall we? Actually, let's have a quick look at these guys first. Just for tradition's sake. Don't really need a trowel. Okay, guys, if it crosses, cross it. There goes the vape, vape vent cover. That's a surprise. Don't need any of that stuff. Right, all I'm going to do is I'm going to pop up the ladder just very quickly and see what it's like and then come back down and pick this equipment up. And I'm so glad I did. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> you know what, guys? I'm. Not really seeing this as a viable escape method, you know. Okay, let's have a look. All our bits and pieces are still there. Excellent. Uh, we have to do this day because you don't save when you get busted and put into solitary. Um, little oversight there, Christy. I would really love if it saved the game at that point. So I shall play through this day, save and upload. And I'll record another episode when we try again. But I think, to be totally honest, if I go up there and get instantly busted again, we'll put that down to a bug, and I will do a quick tunnel out instead. Alright, so, off to breakfast. Do I still have a job? I still have a job. I have plenty of money to uh, pick up bits and pieces, so what we need now is the today is to get a file so I can get through that uh, vent again. I've got some paper mache to make a face fake vent. Oh dear. What a surprise. I don't think that particular escape method likes me. Actually, it just reminded me. Yep, yeah, all the stats have gone down again as well. Oh dear. This is. There we go. My virus scanner just popped up and this got very laggy at the same time. And I hope you guys didn't see it. Four, five, six. Three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. That should be enough. Right, let's go and see if we can get some stats up. I think we've got plenty of time to do a little bit of reading in the library. So, that was a bit of a disaster. Oh, Ricky, would you give it a rest? Just, I keep on coming along and stealing from you. I'm not entirely certain what I've done to offend him. I mean, I've beaten him up a few times and not done some of the tasks he's asked me to do and... Admittedly stored a load of contraband in his desk, but apart from that, I've no real idea why he's offended uh, Offended by my presence. I mean, it just makes no sense to me at all uh, There you go I'm actually starting to think get the feeling that there's actually uh, just a game mechanic that says somebody won't like you in this prison 
Right, roll call. Hopefully one of these fine fellows will have a file to sell me. A file from fine a fi a file from a fine fellow. F yeah, that was hard to say. Probably blew up my pop filter as well, but there we go. Uh, not you. Ricky refuses to trade with me, of course. And, uh, there we go. There's the other seller. Nice of you to join us, Ross. Nothing. Right. Okay, well, let's get through the afternoon. I'll save, I'll upload this. Do the next one. Oh, perhaps one of these guys. Ah, Pierre. What a surprise. Okay, Adele, what do you got? Nothing I'm interested in. Pierre, what do you got? Loads of stuff. I think I'm just going to have all that on general principle, actually. So, crafting note, fake vent cover, know that one. Timber race, know that one. Now we need to hide that duct tape somewhere. Okay, and in fact, Ricky, because you're such a nice chap, I'm going to hide it in your desk. There we go. Okay. Do I have a weapon? No, I don't have a weapon. Let's make a weapon. Just for the sake of it. Uh, let's have a toothbrush shiv this time. There we go. And the interesting thing is, if it's there, as opposed to in your inventory, it won't set off the metal detectors. And I suppose I could have had that uh, butt duct tape, but don't really need it. A little bit of speed over there, so okay. Okay, I'm not exactly a fan of this escape attempt anymore. As I said, I'm going to give it one more go. Then I'm going to go to the tried and tested method of just digging a hole and walking out that way. I hope you forgive me, but I think the fun of that particular escape method is starting to wear off, to be honest with you. Uh, there you go. Right, exercise period. Let's do a bit more speed work, shall we? Which means we got to get there before anyone that fills up the, sp the treadmills. Where am I? There we go. Okay. Right, so day 70. Um, yeah, um... Actually, that's the point. This is probably the second time we've been around day 70. Uh, truth of the matter is that uh, the older backup wasn't the latest backup, so um, uh, it was back a couple of days, to be honest with you, uh, which had a, actually had an advantage that meant some of the stuff that we had from the last breakout, not all, but some, some of that stuff was uh, um Saved so it cut me down on a bit of work, a bit of time getting reorganized for this run. So, not so bad there. Okay, uh, incidentally, chaps, uh, and chapesses, of course, yes, chapettes. I won't say chapatis, that one's totally wrong. Um, I have a day off tomorrow. I intend to do that, uh, spend that day. Well, basically, the morning is going to be moving my little office downstairs into a room with better acoustics and better ventilation. And the afternoon, I'm intending to do just a load of recording if I can. Um, I want to finish off that Space Engineers series and start putting that up. Um, is if I find some time I want to finish off uh, the next episode of the Kerbal Space Engineer series and there's um, another Sims 3 playthrough that I've been challenged to do by uh, a couple of commenters on the channel so I want to get that a bit further so hopefully there'll be a bit of a few bits and pieces on the channel oh let's actually 
actually let's get rid of our fatigue rather than do something else a few bits and pieces on the channel worth watching tomorrow or it could just be the normal rubbish that I put up on a daily basis anyway one or the other possibly both if I fall down the stairs and drop the computer probably neither but uh, we'll see we'll see okay evening free time 20 minutes which is 20 seconds until evening roll call so I might as well just stand here and look smart tonight we shall just go to bed because we don't have a file and I'll put this up next version next episode we'll have one more crack at getting out through the the roof and if that just happens again I'm gonna dig a hole sorry chaps okay um, actually may as well let's have a quick look at what's on sale might be something interesting not that lot mind oh actually Carl just in case I'll have that talcum powder thank you very much Ricky won't deal with me Jared's got nothing I'm particularly interested in Pierre is in his favorite state which is unconscious let's move that desk so I can sleep right guys uh, set um, thank you very much apologize for the delays I hope you will forgive me I feel I've got a good excuse this time um, if you like this please leave a like if you want to see some more please subscribe you know the deal by now thank you very much and good night